Hello students. In this session, we are going to learn how to find antilog for a given negative value. So negative value uh, will be there and for which we need to take antilog. There are two situations which will warrant this. The first one is we may need to find out the concentration of hydrogen ion or hydroxyl ion if a pH or pOH was given. The second one is we may need to find out the concentration of the ion that undergoes reduction in the electrochemical cell using Nernst equation. Now let me take a simple um, I mean a, a, a problem. For example, if pH is given like uh, 2.73, right? Now I know that pH is nothing but negative log of hydrogen ion concentration, right? So I'm going to just substitute 2.73 is equal to minus log of hydrogen ion concentration. Now to take, a, I may um, cross, I may multiply with minus one, then I may get a log of H plus ion concentration, right? Uh, then I need to take anti-log so as to cancel this log, right? So anti-log of uh, minus 2.73 is equal to H plus ion. See now, how to take anti-log for this negative number? That's what we are going to learn in this session. Now there are actually two ways to do this. Let me take the same example, okay? So uh, anti-log of minus 2.73 is equal to H plus ion concentration, right? I'm going to explain the both ways. So uh, this is method one. In method one, uh, we need not to uh, go to this stage. Instead, we need to go uh, stay with the previous stage that is uh, minus 2.73 is equal to log of H plus ion or else uh, you have minus over here, right? Now, this can also be written as log of H plus ion concentration to the power minus 1. And I can write like a log of 1 by H plus ion concentration, right? Now, which is nothing but 2.73. Now, I want you to take anti-log. So, now anti-log of 2.73 is equal to 1 by H plus ion, right? This log will get cancelled. Now, you just cross multiply. H plus ion concentration is equal to 1 by anti-log of 2.73. Now you may get the value, right? Now the second method is very simple and interesting. So that is method 2. I am going to take the same uh, value, right? So anti-log of uh, minus 2.73 is equal to hydrogen ion concentration, right? Now the, decimal, the digit that is present before the decimal point will be called as characteristic. We know this. And uh, the decimal point, the, the digits which are present after the decimal point will be known as mantissa. Right? Now I want you to add minus 1 to the characteristic part. Right? And after that, after adding, we need to raise that number to the uh, 10 to the power. Right? So it will be like... Uh, that is in your answer you will be having 10 to the power and it is minus 2 plus minus 1 that is nothing but 10 to the power minus 3 right now this mantissa part should be subtracted from 1 okay so from 1 it is 7 3 which means you will get 0 0.27 now for this number that is you need to take antilog for 0 0.27 now when we find what is the antilog for this number 0 0.27 I got that 1862 so 1862 is the number 1862 and since I have 0 I need to put decimal point after a number so this is the value of uh, the antilog of minus 2.73 it's very easy now let us do this problem so as to understand uh, how it works okay so find the concentration of hydrogen ion if the pH of the solution is 11.26. So pH is given and I need to find out a hydrogen ion concentration. Just uh, observe that uh, pH is 11.26 which means the solution is basic. So H plus ion concentration will be very very low. right? Anyway, we know that pH is negative log of hydrogen ion concentration. So just substitute 11.26 is equal to minus log of hydrogen ion concentration or else I can write a hydrogen ion concentration is equal to anti-log of minus 11.26 correct 
fine so as i um i mean uh, we learned we need to add minus 1 to the characteristic part right so that is going to be your answer so in answer 10 to the power minus 11 minus 1 which means minus 12 right and i need to subtract this uh, mandisa part from 1 so 1.0026 so i'll get 7 0.74 so i need to take anti log for this uh, number 0.74 so anti log of 0.74 is um, the 5495 so i need to put a decimal point over here because i have zero here okay so the answer is 5.495 into 10 to the power minus 2 mole per liter so that is your answer thank you guys